I'm going to take a minute and show you the difference between a standard profile tube and a low profile tube. With your standard profile tube, this is essentially a one size fits all tube. And the way that you can make accommodations for changes in weight is to move this external bolster up and down the tube so that it fits properly. With these tubes, the feeding port is attached at the end. With the low profile device, sometimes called a button, they come in different sizes. This is the stem length here, and they come in different sizes to accommodate different patient weights and sizes as well. So with these tubes, they need to be fitted and sized for that individual patient's needs. And as patients change in their weight, like with children who are gaining weight, the tube needs to be upsized so that the stem length fits properly. Now when it's time to feed, you need an extension set with low profile devices. So this is a bolus extension set that you would plug into the feeding port and this is where you would access for, feed, for feeding time. So that is the main difference between a standard profile tube and a low profile tube.